Imagine a city that has stood the test of time, a city that breathes history and culture. Welcome to Damascus, a city that has witnessed the rise and fall of countless empires, the ebb and flow of world-changing events. It has been home to artists, scholars and merchants, a vibrant hub of human civilization for thousands of years. Damascus, the capital of Syria, is famed as one of the oldest continuously inhabited cities in the world. Its rich and diverse history stretches back for more than seven millennia. It has seen the dawn of civilization, the birth of empires, and the spread of the world's great religions. The city's architecture is a testament to its storied past. From the ancient city walls to the towering minarets and grand palaces, every stone tells a story. The cityscape is a mosaic of different eras. Roman columns stand alongside Islamic arches, while modern buildings rise amidst ancient ruins. The city's heart, the Old Quarter, is a labyrinth of narrow alleyways and bustling souks. Here, you can find everything from intricately woven carpets and handmade jewelry, to aromatic spices and local delicacies. The sounds of haggling vendors, the scent of fresh bread and roasting coffee beans, the sight of colorful textiles and gleaming brassware, all contribute to the sensory feast that is the Damascus souk. But the soul of Damascus lies in its rich cultural heritage. It's a city where tradition and modernity intermingle, where ancient customs are treasured and preserved. Here, poets recite verses under the shade of old sycamore trees, while musicians strum the strings of the oud, filling the air with haunting melodies. As we embark on this journey, the melodic sounds of the oud, an ancient stringed instrument, will guide us through the city's enchanting streets. The oud, with its deep, resonant sound, is more than just a musical instrument. It's a bridge to Damascus's past. The oud, a pear-shaped stringed instrument, is an integral part of Middle Eastern music, steeped in a rich history that dates back thousands of years. This captivating instrument, often crafted from highly prized woods, features 11 or 13 strings and has a range that spans over two octaves. Its unique sound, both warm and melancholic, is a product of its distinctive construction and the player's nuanced approach to plucking and strumming. The Odi's history is as rich and deep as its sound. Often cited as the precursor to the European lute, the Oud has played a central role in Arab music for over 5,000 years. From the courtrooms of ancient Sumeria to the bustling markets of medieval Damascus, the Oed's resonant melodies have echoed through time, carrying with them stories of love, loss, and life. In the context of Damascus, the Oyud's music is a timeless soundtrack that sets the mood for exploration. Its deep resonant tones evoke the city's ancient past, transporting listeners through winding alleys, past towering minarets and into bustling souks. It's as if the Oyud's melodies are imbued with the city's history, echoing the laughter, whispers and footsteps of those who walked the city's streets centuries ago. The music of the Oyud is not just a backdrop but an active participant in the exploration of Damascus. It enhances the experience, adding depth and texture to the city's rich tapestry. Its melodies guide us like oral breadcrumbs through the city's complex history, its triumphs and trials, its vibrant present, and into its promising future. So, when you hear the Oud, remember that you're not just listening to music. You're hearing the heartbeat of Damascus, the rhythm of its past, and the melody of its future. You're experiencing a living, breathing city through its most enduring voice. With each strum, the Oud spins tales of ancient civilizations, guiding us deeper into the heart of Damascus. As the Oud plays, we begin our exploration, starting with the city's ancient walls. These walls, which have withstood the test of time, are a testament to Damascus's rich and storied past. They have been silent witnesses to the city's growth, its wars, its triumphs, and its transformations. Our journey takes us next to the Umayyad Mosque, also known as the Great Mosque of Damascus. This architectural marvel is one of the oldest and largest mosques in the world. It stands as a symbol of the city's spiritual heart, and its history is as fascinating as the city itself. The mosque was built in the early 8th century, but the site has been sacred ground for millennia, having been home to a temple, a church, and now, a mosque. The mosque's intricate mosaics, grand courtyard, and towering minarets are awe-inspiring. Its beauty is enhanced by the harmonious melodies of the oud, playing softly in the background, adding a layer of serenity to the already peaceful atmosphere. From the Umayyad Mosque, we move towards the Citadel of Damascus. This historic site, located in the northwestern corner of the city's old town, is a fortress with a history spanning several millennia. It has been occupied by many civilizations, each leaving their mark on its architecture and design. 
The Citadel's formidable walls and towers are reminders of a time when Damascus was a strategic stronghold, a city to be coveted and defended. As the Oud's tunes echo off the Citadel's ancient stones, they seem to bring the past to life, creating a vibrant tapestry of sounds that weave together history and music in a unique and captivating way. Our journey continues as we venture into the city's bustling souks, or marketplaces. These souks are the lifeblood of Damascus, filled with the sounds of bartering, the scent of spices, and a kaleidoscope of colors from the myriad of goods on display. Here the music of the Oud merges with the market's lively soundscape, forming a symphony of everyday life. The Souk al Hamidiyya, the city's largest and most famous souk, is a must-visit. Its vaulted metal ceiling, pockmarked with bullet holes from past conflicts, tells a story of resilience and survival. The souk is a treasure trove of everything from traditional Syrian sweets to handcrafted jewelry, textiles, and of course, Ouds. As we navigate through the narrow alleyways, the Ouds music acts as our guide, leading us deeper into the heart of Damascus. The music resonates with the city's heartbeat, creating a harmonious blend of sound and sensation, history, and culture. Our journey takes us next to the Straight Street, the Roman street that runs from east to west in the Old City. It's lined with a range of historical sites, including the House of Ananias, an early Christian site, and the Roman Temple of Jupiter. The Oud's melodies fill the air, their notes dancing between the ancient buildings, adding an extra layer of charm to this historic street. Our exploration of Damascus is not just a journey through space but also time. Each site, each landmark has a story to tell, and the Oud's music enhances these narratives, bridging the gap between the past and the present, between history and the here and now. The city, under the spell of the Oud, unfolds its stories, its secrets, and its soul. Each tune, each melody, is a key that unlocks another aspect of Damascus, revealing a city that is as complex as it is captivating, as historic as it is vibrant. As we journey through Damascus, we are not just observers but participants in a symphony of history, culture, and music that is as timeless as the city itself. The Oud's music is more than just a soundtrack to our journey, it's a vital part of the experience. Indeed, the role of ambient Oud music as we explore Damascus cannot be overstated. Like a soft whisper in the wind, it seeps into every corner, every alley, every stone of the city, becoming a living, breathing part of its ancient soul. The Oud's melodies, rich and resonating, set the mood for our exploration. They are the echo of countless footsteps that have walked these streets before us, the murmur of stories told and retold over the centuries. Each note is a thread in the vast tapestry of Damascus's history, weaving together tales of love, loss, hope, and resilience. Ambient out music doesn't merely accompany our journey, it propels it. It's the heartbeat that drives our exploration, the rhythm that guides our steps. It's the soundtrack to the city's past and to our adventure within it. It's the voice of Damascus, speaking to us in a language that transcends words, touching our hearts and stirring our souls. This music doesn't just create a sense of immersion, it envelops us, immerses us in the city's past, its culture, its spirit. The Oud's music allows us to feel the pulse of the city, to breathe in its essence, to become a part of its ongoing narrative. It's more than just music, it's an experience, a journey, a voyage into the heart of Damascus. The role of ambient Oud music in our journey is like the role of a key in a lock. It opens doors to hidden places, to forgotten times, to the very soul of the city. It allows us to see Damascus not just as it is but as it once was, and as it always will be, a city of stories, of history, of life. The Oud's music serves as a key that unlocks the city's past, bringing the ancient city of Damascus to life. As our journey through Damascus comes to an end, the echoes of the Oud linger, leaving a lasting impression. We've traversed the ancient city, soaking in its rich history and vibrant culture, embarking on a voyage that has captivated our senses and stirred our souls. The echoes of the past resonate in every corner of this city, whispering tales of a time long gone, yet still very much alive in the present. Our exploration began with the Oud, an instrument steeped in tradition, the sound of which has become synonymous with the city itself. This instrument has been our guide, its music setting the rhythm of our journey, its melody painting an auditory picture of Damascus. It has been the soundtrack to our exploration, enhancing every experience, making the past feel palpable and the city's spirit tangible. From the bustling souks to the tranquil courtyards the Odid's music has been our constant companion. 
It has transformed our journey into an immersive experience, one where history, culture, and music intertwine to create a tapestry of sensory delight. It has made us feel, hear, and in some ways even touch the soul of Damascus. The music of the ode has a way of seeping into you, becoming a part of your very being. It has the power to transport you, to take you on a journey beyond the physical, into a realm where time stands still and all that exists is the present moment. It is in this space that we've truly connected with Damascus, understanding its essence and appreciating its beauty. As we bid farewell to the city, we carry with us not just memories but a piece of Damascus itself. The Oud's music once heard cannot be forgotten, it lingers much like the city's spirit long after the journey has ended, it leaves a mark, etching itself into our hearts, becoming a part of our own personal histories. In the heart of Damascus, the Oud's music continues to resonate, a timeless testament to this ancient city's enduring spirit.